Hey Cancer, welcome to my channel. This is the next 24 hours love and general tarot reading session for you, Cancer. I hope you are well. I hope you're fine and safe and doing good. This reading for today is for the Cancer friends out there. What can I get for Cancer, please? What is the love message and general situationship message that is meant for you to know and ready for you to know? This is for you, Cancer, okay? I would like to thank you for being here. Thank you for supporting my channel. Yes, viewers, if you haven't clicked the subscribe button and the bell, please do it now if you're interested and if you are keen. And let's see what's coming towards you, Cancer. What is the message for you? All right, here you go. First card is you've got the six of wands in the reverse, okay? Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. You've got the Emperor card in the reverse. I feel like your, your manager or your boss is not supporting you. I feel like this is a situation at work or business or collaborative. Like it's a it's not a love energy. Um, if you feel intuitively that a person in your team at home at work is not supporting you, yes, you are correct. Okay, so if you're gonna challenge this person or the team, if or if you're gonna present something that would be needing an approval. Please be aware that this person is not supportive. So it's it's more of a reading where it's more the message is for your awareness, for your information that you cannot rely on them. Like they won't they won't cover for you. You don't got like you know that saying that I got your back. This person is not okay. So if you're re relying for this person to support you, no. So if you're looking for some sort of alliance or support, this is a no-no. Mm -hmm. you, you don't... Also, for some of you, company-wise, like maybe group-wise, maybe you're opening up your feelings or venting your worries and concerns. This is a person that you cannot trust. I'm telling you right now. Yeah, move away from this person because they could create... You might... Hopefully not, but like it might get you to trouble when it comes to money and business it is not a friend it is a foe so five of cups in reverse you know four or five i mean it's you're still like you still have other people that can support you they're not the only asset that can support you to your dreams to your ambition to your project okay so I don't know. I feel like you're so comfortable with this person, but I feel like they're two-faced. It's related to work, job, a collaborative team. Five of Cups. Don't worry too much about not getting this person's opinion, not getting their side, not getting their support. There is other people that supports you. Okay? Oh, look at that. See? There's other people company you know in general there is a specific person or situation that you would like to get their attention or support there are other outside forces people situation that would like to collaborate with you remember not remember that and if you force this this person can cause you trouble to be honest with you okay so careful on who you mingle connect share your worries and concern or vent at home at work or something that you could be put in trouble they don't got they don't they, they you got their back but they they will they will not back you up for something okay let's move on let's see let's see what else is coming towards you cancer seven of swords stalker alert ten of wands okay i feel like oh okay there once upon a time <laughs> So once upon a time, you dated a person. They were unavailable. They're not committed. They were a player. Okay, You dated a person. They were a player. Um, now, this person is coming back. They're very... They joke a lot. You know, this person, they joke a lot. Sometimes they joke half men. Because I see them connecting with you. Hey, do you want me to be... When I said that, I saw 4 minutes, 44 seconds. I mean, this person is joking. Hey, what's up, Cancer? Do you want to have a relationship? Do you want to get married? Do you want a baby? Like, 
it sounds like a joke. So there is someone in the past who would like to connect with you romantically. They're joking, but it's half meant, you know, seven of swords, ten of wands. But deep, deep inside, that joke is, it, they meant it. That they really want to get married. They want to have a long-term commitment. They want you. But they are saying that they want you into something of a joke. Like they, they could not deliver the message uh, seriously. And nine of swords, like you're confusing me. Like you could not take them seriously because it does somehow, half of it sounds serious, half of it, half of it, it's not. So, you know, there's a person that would return and somehow this person is causing you confusion, you know? Yeah, justice card. So it's it's about time to realign and pay back the karma. Um, when this person return or connect or call you or text you, you're the one with the upper hand. Like you're the one in control. They're more in the chaser. And um, yeah, you know, I'd I would recommend to really be blunt with this person and don't play jokes with you. Know? Quit playing game with my heart. Quit playing game with my heart, with my heart. Because they're joking. They're joking. They, you know, a person, when they don't want to be rejected, they will joke. They'll see and test how you are going to take it. So this is the, the message of the intuitive to you is that, hmm, they meant it, but they just don't know how to deliver it. So if you reject them, at least it wouldn't hurt because they're going to say that it's a joke. Okay. So, yes. Okay, let's see what else is coming towards you, Cancer. What is the message for Cancer, please? What can I get for Cancer? What's the message for Cancer? What's that? Okay, All right. This card wanted to come out. Page of Wands, not so good news. Three of Wands. I feel like there's some sort of delay. Delay when it comes to travel or planning. It could be related to weather. Okay, two cards wanted to come out. Okay. So, Eight of Cups, oh, it can resume, and Nine of Wands, okay. All right, for some of you, I'm getting two vibe, okay. You know, there was this person that you always plan, let's meet, let's catch up. It always get canceled. It's either you're not available, they're not available, available or, or pandemic, or the weather. So, what they're telling me is that don't get frustrated. Don't get, don't get frustrated because... They will come back to you with a solid, a solid strategy on how you will meet. Okay. You will be able to date or catch up or meet with this person. It will happen. Okay. So if there's this one person that you've been dying to meet them, to see them, to embrace them, to kiss them, it will happen. Okay. So don't give up. I mean, it's just probably a lot of delay, but for them, it just makes them so excited. I see them returning, Eight of Cups, Knight of Wands, with a much, much better plan. All right? So, this is your reading. Thank you so much, Cancer, for tuning in. Thanks for being here. A pleasure doing the reading to you. If you like the reading, if you connected with the reading, if you resonated with the reading, I would invite you to click the bell, click subscribe. And also, guys, if you haven't read The New Moon in Leo, we have created a blog online. Um visit the website or I would suggest to check out the description box below the link towards the new moon in Leo, how it's going to affect you. And of course, the mantras, the rituals that you can do in a new moon. It is also, um, we've also created the blog for that, okay? So that is me, private reading, extended reading and manifestation item. It's free shipping worldwide. Amazing, amazing respond, respond, responses from uh, buyers about the manifestation items along with the free guide on how to use it it's in there it's in the website so this is me i will see you soon you take care bye bye